Right, the other day, I was playing on the PlayStation because we're on lockdown, obviously. Um, welcome to my beautiful garden. I've done nothing. Mowed it a couple of times and that. The other day, I was playing on the PlayStation. A good friend of mine, Mr. Barry Mansfield, you know who you are, Ginger Boy, um, decided to message me quickly because another friend of ours, a colleague of the detecting world, decided they were going to sell their machine. I was after a second machine because I use a Nox myself, but I fancy something a little bit more to play with. Hmm. Lo and behold, spoke to the gentleman, Phil Frag. Uh, and we agreed with the price. This, that, the other. Bada bing, bada boom. And guess what turned up this morning? Lucky, lucky, lucky. <gasps> oh, there I am. There I am. I better pull the sticker off. She so don't all know where I live. <sighs> so there you go. And this is how he's done it. So it's like a Christmas present. All right, I'll give you a tip. Any old coins you get that you aren't worth a lot of money. I put them on my keys. But what I did is I got a penny, sharpened the one end to edge up just enough. So if I want to open something, look, I just and it'll open it. So and that's just by using a penny. Look, penny, penny, penny. Put it on my keys, put an hole in it. It's half gone, but I thought, well, using stuff that's, you know, not been used and that lot. So, here we go. I'm unboxing. Unboxing. Give me a second. Because, <gasps> look, box. Can we see this? Can you tell what it is? Oh, look at that. Look at that. He's even put tape on the front. Now I know Philippe has been using this with his mate Sid. So I know it's all good. Oh, look at this. Look, look, spare stickers. Art of England. That's for me Knox. Me knocks, look. Oh, so you've got to love that man. And there, look. So, not only have I got two nice stickers now for my machine, my Nox 800 that I use full time. Oh, look, I've now got. There you are. This is how you do it, isn't it? Some packing material. Some poppers. Where are you going? Get here. It would have to run across the gas. <laughs> oh, sweet. There you go. I've now got an XP aux to play with. And the rubbish is going everywhere because the wind decided to go. You could have cleaned it, Phil. No, I like it when they use, look. Soon give it a clean up. Might do a video of cleaning it. Now, with this metal detector, this young man decided to give me, which I'm quite happy about, is an X35 coil. X35. They're not cheap. They're not cheap at all. Nice little coil, nice little machine, just for a bit of fun. So Philippe, I'm very happy with this, very happy. I shall speak to you later. I hope the charger's in here because I haven't got a charger for it. So I'm going to kick him in the eye if there isn't. Okay, all right then. I shall speak to you in a bit and I'll do a video of me using it after I put it all together. <laughs> 